Welcome to Math We Know. Calculate two to the power of one hundred, the minus two to the power of ninety-nine. How do we solve it? First, you should notice ninety-nine is very close to one hundred. One hundred, the minus one, that is ninety-nine. So now this one hundred should be written as ninety-nine then plus one. Go on. So two to the power one hundred is two to the power of ninety-nine. Plus one, and then minus two to the power of ninety-nine. Okay, and then what should we do? Now I'm going to use a formula that is a to the power of b plus c is equal to a to the power of b, and then times a to the power of c. So now a is two, b is ninety-nine, and c is this one. So use this formula. It can be written as two to the power of ninety-nine, and then times two to the power of one, and then minus two to the power of ninety-nine. Because these two terms have the same factor, have a common factor that is two to the power of ninety-nine. So take it out. Two to the power of ninety-nine, and then times two to the power of one is two. And then minus one, because two to the power of ninety-nine then divided by two to the power of ninety-nine is one. And now what should we do? Calculate two minus one. It is one. So now two to the power of ninety-nine then times one is two to the power of ninety-nine. And this is our answer. And don't forget to give me some thumb, subscribe me, ring the bell. And we'll see you next time. Bye bye.